The year of 2009 was a tragic year for many people in terms of celebrity deaths. Big stars and little stars died this year, one tragedy following another, but one stands out, one changed our lives forever. This is the e-true Hollywood story of Gidget the Chihuahua. Gidget was the face of a fast food phenomenon. She was a small star with a big heart. She was so easy to work with. She, uh, she always knew where the camera was. Just right there, you know. A hero to the Latin canine community. She never forgot where she came from. At the time, a breaking news story shocked the world. 911 emergency. Gidget! She's not breathing! Is this a human, ma'am? No, it's my puppy! She was gone. In the next hour, we'll take a look at the star with the million dollar face and this pup culture icon's fall from grace. Benji, Lassie, Spuds McKenzie, they're all lightweights compared to her. Carlos Alizraki, voice of the Taco Bell Chihuahua spots, remembers the tiny starlet. Uh, this is harder than I thought it would be. I uh, remember the first day I met her, she pooped in my trailer. She always had a great sense of humor. Born under a taco stand in Tijuana, Mexico, Gidget Rosarita Consuela Parida Perez was just another street dog, but she was destined for something more. Fighting her way out of the illegal dog fighting rings of Tijuana, she crossed the border on the back of a coyote. She was discovered on the street out in front of Schwab's in Hollywood by casting director Jenny Tingle. <laughs> she screamed. She thought it was a rat. But it was my Gidget. Can I have a minute? But she wasn't just another pretty face. She had talent. Yo quiero Taco Bell. Yo quiero she was amazing. She played a male chihuahua. She was the Hillary Swank of talking dogs. But at the height of her popularity, tragedy struck. Fame had gone to her tiny, big-eared, bug-eyed head. What began as an experimentation with begging strips led to a stint at Promises for a heavy snossages addiction. And the infamous sex tape leaked onto the internet of her and her stand-in, Dinky. The tabloids reported that she was throwing up her kibble to maintain her figure. I never saw it. She was set to make her comeback in Quentin Tarantino's 101 Reservoir Dogs. But before that could happen, on July 21st, 2009, she crossed the Rainbow Bridge to dog heaven. Seriously, again, I just want to say I'm really, really sorry that I sat on her. Hasta luego, Gidget. <sighs> Te amo, Gidget. Te amo. This has been E! True Hollywood Story, Gidget the Taco Bell Chihuahua.